guys, welcome back with me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Share sleep to learn frames on the session concerns. Europe leaders, United States shares fell sharply, and the dollar surge on Monday as first mount the central bank effort to time raising consumer prices with inflation boosting interest rate hikes will weaken the global economy and lead to a recession. Earlier in Europe, the benchmark STOWX index for regional shares closed down 1% after Russia's gas from MCXGAZP said it would have natural gas supplies to Europe for three days at the end of the month. Oil, oil at first fell 4% as traders bet a slowdown within demand, but the latest disruption to energy supplies in Europe heightened concerns about the continent's economic outlook after hawkish signal from European Central Bank's policymakers. Russian natural gas supplies to Europe are down around 75% year on year. A closely monitored recession signal the inflation of the United States Treasury's yield curve within it as the market brace for IMEX on Friday from Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell, who will discuss at Jackson Hall, who mean the first mission, mission the lower inflation. The dollar string had knocking the euro below parity at 0.9400 and pushing the Canadian dollar to breach 1.30% against the greenback. The strong dollar led gold prices to fall to their lowest level in nearly four weeks. Ahead of Jackson how the dollar is going to remain relatively framed even though its overextended said mark candle safe market strategies at Bucconic Burn Global Forex. Despite a quick shift toward a more hawkish view of the Fed, the market has this habit of really powerful to to be the fish. So I see the risk of buy the rumor, the rumor of a hawkish fit, and then sell it on the fact, he said. Fed funds future are now pricing in a 54.5% change of a 75 basis point hike by the Fed in September, instead of the greater probability of a 50 basis point hikes as the market had expected going into the weekend. A retail poll of economists taken August 16 until 19 forecast the Fed will raise rates by 70 basis points in September, with the risk toward a higher peak. The Treasury yield curve measuring the gap between yields on two and ten year notes inferred to twenty nine point seven basis points after easing a bit last week in a sign recession bids have increased. The inferred yield curve is suddenly a massive recession is upon us, said Tom D. Guloma, managing director at C4 Global Holdings. In a nod to investors, yield curve inflations are great prediction of recession. The Dow Jones Industrial Average closed down 1.91%, the S&P 500 lost 2.5%. 14% and the Nasdaq Composite filled 2.55% as all 11 of the major S&P 500 sales lead. Declining shares 
outnumber those advancing by a more than 5-1 ratio and the New York Stock Exchange. Declining shares outnumber those advancing by a more than 5-1 ratio on the New York Stock Exchange. The S&P 500 has repeatedly failed to clear its 200-day moving average around 4,000 a 3200 a sign it would be pulling out of a beer market. The 10-year not rose 4 basis points in price to yield one expansion to the tightening trend is China, where the central bank trimmed some key lending rates, rates by between 5 and 15 basis points on Monday in a bid to support a slowing economy and a stressed housing sector. MS, MSCI's birthday's index of Asia Pacific shares outside Japan fell 0.97% while its United States centric index of shares across the globe slid 1.8% I think that's all maybe from me don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe